Welcome back to Funniest Pets and People. You can't count on anyone to laugh at you more than a friend. Hey, Emily. Wow, now that's something, huh? <laughs> Candace here has done an excellent job training her dog, Lolita, to fetch her tissues. <laughs> Which comes in pretty handy, because Candace is allergic to dogs. <laughs> Have you seen my bone? Nope. Well, look again, will you? Okay. See it? Nope. No bone. Are you sure? I'm sure. Well, look again. I already looked. Oh, wait a minute. I, I see it in there. Well, I saw my chew toys. <laughs> How'd those things get there? <laughs> Look at these two grooving, will ya? They really seem to know their steps. We're guessing they were listening to that new rap star, Busta Rim. Look at this birdie pecking away at this girl's teeth. Getting every little crumb. I guess some kids will do anything to get out of brushing. Check out that little dog tugging the leash there, will you? <laughs> You're probably curious why he's trying so hard to take his pal for a walk. <laughs> well, he's not. He's just embarrassed for his little friend because he's got that stupid cone on his hand. He's a cone head dog. If Simon knew anything about himself, he knew this. He would always return to the sea. <laughs> Maybe just a little sooner than he planned. <laughs> now it's time for Funniest Pets and People Unleashed. <laughs> this woman just discovered a bird nesting under her ponytail. You need to run a brush through your hair time to time. <laughs> Bob Bob knows the rules, and so he knows he shouldn't be drinking from the dog's bowl. <laughs> but if his paw happens to get wet, He's got to lick it off, right? Oh, please, be reasonable. Oh, my. Now, this is a tough wedding reception. First, this fellow with the beard clocks his friend. And he gets kicked in the head himself. Are they gonna toss the bouquet? With a slingshot. <laughs> Pappy was really disappointed. After years of planning, he had the pool, he had the float, had the sunglasses, he even had the cool visor. <laughs> but somehow, well, it just didn't feel as exciting as it looked on Baywatch. <laughs> they say birds aren't geniuses, but this one's an amazing escape artist. The minute his owner's gone, he unlocks his cage, opens the door, slips out, and climbs free. Uh, well, to another cage where he locks himself in again with another bird. <laughs> oh, well.
well, you know, maybe they're not geniuses, but you can't say they're not friendly. <laughs> this family was happy enough to host the bride and groom's wedding. They invited all their friends, they made the food, and they wanted to give them a proper toast. But when those two broke their good crystal, well, that was enough. <laughs> this is what you call a win-win for the pony. If the box of feet is empty, he can still eat the box. <laughs> Watch this, as this thrill seeker nails this jump. The good news, he's A-OK. -okay. And he picked up a frequent flyer mile. Everybody has heard that saying, his bark is worse than his bite, right? Which is just what's making that little fella so upset in the first place. <laughs> and here's a clip that kind of puts things in perspective. For those of you who don't believe exercise helps you lose weight, <laughs> two weeks ago, this cat was a mountain lion. A Siamese mountain lion, but a mountain lion nonetheless. Coming up, some sledding crashers. And a cat has fun bowling. <laughs> <laughs>